How's it going guys? It's Bilu here and today we have a special tutorial. I wanted to show you guys, I know one of you guys were asking, I wanted to show you guys how you split up your webcam and your display or your games, whatever, on the other side so that you can edit them separately so that you have a more cohesive video. And so that way, if you need to only show gameplay or only show your webcam, you can do that flawlessly. So we're gonna show you this. All right, so we're gonna go to the settings, right? We're gonna go down here, the settings. You're gonna go to video. Now you see this, 1920 by 1080. What you're gonna wanna do is double that size. So the first number, you're gonna wanna double that. So the horizontally, it's twice as long. So that, in this case, is gonna be 3840. So 3840. And then you can delete that first number. All right. Now you come down here to output scaled resolution. Do the same thing. All right. Hit apply. And you'll see that it doubled. Now I can't do my webcam right now. But you're going to put your webcam in the left side. Right. So on the left side. See we got the right side. This is what's going to be your game. And then the left side is going to be your webcam. So what you're going to do, put your webcam and you're just going to move it, scale it, make sure it fits this on the left side. And then your display, your game is going to be on the other side. All right. Now I can't show you that because I already have a system of OBS running to record this video. So I can't do it separately, but that's how it's going to work. So you got your webcam on the left and your display or your game on the right. So that way, when you edit it, you can duplicate the video and then crop it out. I'm going to show you that in video editing so that you're not confused. So we're going to go into the video editing process, and then I'll show you that. All right, so I opened DaVinci Resolve. Now this process is going to be a little different based on what editing software you have, um, but they all have a cropping feature. So I'm going to show you what to do. First, so you pull up whatever video you have into your software. And now what we're going to do is we're going to take all of the tracks, right? Most most editing software, they link the clips. So down here, it says link clips. We just unclick that so that they're no longer connected. Um, and what that does is when we go to duplicate the video, it doesn't duplicate the audio as well. So first, um, we're going to duplicate the video. So in this one, it's actually alt. A lot of them, it's going to be alt. Um, but basically you duplicate it by just dragging it to the next video tab. So we're going to drag it up there. Now we have two different ones. All right. Now I muted the track so you can't hear anything, but what we have is two different tracks and what we're going to need to do is crop them. So this one, this one right here, this bottom one, that's actually the back of your video. So this is what you're going to want in the background. Normally, it's going to be your gameplay. So we're going to crop this. All right. So we're going to go over to this little, this little clicker where it says transform. We're going to go to crop. All right. Now you're going to see this. We're going to drag our gameplay so that it's the only thing showing. All right. So you just drag it all the way to the half mark. All right. That looks good. Now what we're going to do is hit transform. Now. Uh, a lot of them, they're going to let you resize like this. You just got to figure out how to do that in your editing software. But what I like to do is keep it where it's at. All right. And you can just drag it. Keep dragging it until you fill up the bar. All right. That looks about right. So then we're going to drag this. Right like that. All right. Make it fill up that entire screen. So that it's a full video. Now you can unclick that. And we got to do the same thing with our webcam. So we go click on the top layer. And you'll see this is in front. So that's what we want. We're going to crop this. Crop whatever we want. Normally it'll do a little bit less on each side. Crop it. Transform. And now we can move this over. Right? And that's how you separate them. Um, now, depending on your software, again, it's going to be a little bit of a different process. So you're going to have to figure it out, but they all have crop features. 
So you're going to be able to do it no matter what software you're using. And look at that. You can hit transform again. And that's it's going to play out like you want. So we can play. See? Now the game plays in the background and your webcam's up front. And in this case, that way, if you want to say, let's do like a dramatic, a dramatic face cam, you, we can just go in here and we can make this part, click transform. Now you can increase the size of this without having to change your gameplay. So like, I don't know if it's going to play very accurately, but this thing It'll just increase dramatically for dramatic effect, and then it'll go back to where it was whenever you're done stopping the clip. All right. So that way you can make more dramatic edits to your video to make it a lot funnier. Um, and if you want to zoom in to the game separately, you can also like clip that, do that, and then transform this separately. Like you'll see in my video, that I already edited this video. But in my video, I've done it a few times where you can just increase this, or let's say for this specific scene, you want to take out the webcam. All you have to do is delete this part. You delete selected. That. So that way, let's say you want to zoom in and that, you can just do it without having your webcam there. So you can. There's so many editing options using this way, and that's the way that I prefer to do it. It just makes it so much easier, so that way you're not stuck with just your webcam on your gameplay, and that it's like kind of burned into it. That way you can do what you want creatively um, in the editing process. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, smash that like button, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!